2K, y'all need y'all ass beat. What the hell is going on? What's good, YouTube? It's your man, Rage King, back with another one. Yes, another upload to the channel. And before we get started, I'd ask if you please go down there and hit that like button, hit that sub button, hit that share button, and hit that bell for notifications if you're new. Welcome to Realm of Rage TV. This is how we do Rage and Rebels. Crown up. And if you're new to the crew, welcome to the Rage and Rebel Revolution. Now let's vibe. And y'all, this right here. It's just yet another slap in the face to NBA 2K players that just want to play a good basketball game. Here you, on your screen right here, you see a list of all the artists that are going to be on the 2K beats. All the songs you hear in the background or may or may not turn off as you stream or upload videos on. This was just so important to 2K to put this out before we get any kind of gameplay. Now, I made a video earlier uh, earlier in the month that said, uh, well, earlier last month, well, a couple, uh, about a couple weeks ago, that said uh, the, bi the build, the, the meta build for this game would be either Kevin Durant, Dirk Nowitzki, or, you know, a big man build. And yet, sure as the, sure as the days are long and the sun is hot in the month of June and August, these SOBs right here, instead of giving us gameplay, give us artists no one cares about this 2k i want y'all to hear me and hear me good no one cares about who in the hell is gonna have a soundtrack on the game no one cares this right here is irrelevant this is when you try to make irrelevant things relevant i guess it's just more relevant this year because now you get to become a rapper or a fashion designer right the Migos build. Make sure you get three of them. Get you an offset, a takeoff, and a Quavo build. Because that's going to be the meta of the game, right? Not a basketball game. Not the game of basketball. Not basketball IQ, but the rappers are going to be the meta build for this game. You're going to have the Sweetie and the Doja Cat build. Is this a Sweetie that got... Is this a Sweetie build before or after she got with Quavo? Oh, don't forget about the Meg the Stallion, a.k.a. Greg the Stallion build, who's probably going to have Hall of Fame uh, ankle breaker, ankle breaker badges right off the bat. Ain't that right, Tory Lanez? She going to have the, the she going to have the hop along badge, too, since she didn't got her ass shot in the foot. Because she probably has what I think she has and showed Tory Lanez and that is a dick. I, I, I can't believe so. So so the gun and the young thug build. Are going to be the meta, right? The Jordan Lyles build is going to be what's hot, right? The Jack Harlow and the Juice World build, not a not a Kareem Abdul-Jabbar build, not the game of basketball, but a Nas build, right? A Dreamville build with J Cole, who may or may not be on the African national team. Stop. Oh, and don't forget about the world famous Thundercat Bill, whoever the hell that is. Stop, 2K. Just stop. Where is the gameplay? This kind of crap right here is exactly why more and more people are losing faith in you as a whole. Because you have nothing to show, but you want everybody's money. That's not how this works. I don't know what country or what bullshit uh, uh, speech y'all had at 2K this year or, or been having or who the hell y'all got running the shots, whoever it is, fire. As, as a matter of fact, I think y'all need to go ahead and just clean house because y'all don't even make video games to be fun anymore. Y'all literally just make them just to say y'all made them. All flash, no substance, nothing new, and the things that are new are things that aren't even new. They are things y'all were simply too lazy to put in the game before that y'all just decided to not be lazy and put in this game. And let's be honest, even that was lazy because none of the innovations are new. This ain't innovative. Y'all were just a little bit less lazy than what y'all were the year before. But you're still lazy bastards. Come on with this. How do you expect people to want to spend, dig in their pockets, spend their money on 2K beats? Am I buying a video game or a fucking mixtape? 
Because I can't tell a damn difference no more. I don't even know what the hell I'm even looking at. I thought I was trying to look for a basketball game, but yet all I'm getting is Death Jam Streets for Vendetta without the fighting. All I am getting is Just Dance. All I am getting is Guitar Hero. All wrapped into one big shit ball that y'all gonna try to sell for a hundred plus dollars. Explain to me how that makes sense. I'm gonna ask 2K some questions. Where is the improvement in gameplay? What are y'all gonna do about these horrible servers? Are Cronus Zens going to be a problem again this year? See, these are the things that y'all need to be answering. These are the questions that need to be asked, and yet somehow, some way, your answer to all of that, all of that is to be a rapper, be Vera Wang or Ralph Lauren. Be fruit of the loom. Go be a runway model. Who in the hell buys a basketball game to become a rapper or a fashion designer? Stop. Stop with this wannabe NBA GTA 2K crap. Because that's exactly what this is. Absolute crap. I want to play basketball. Not make beats with Metro Boom and want some more, nigga. We want to play basketball. Not be with Gunner and Young Thug talking about some everything. Lady, I love when it's hot. Whatever the hell he said after that. We want to play basketball, not make beats with the Lamonts, whoever the hell that is. We want to play basketball, not sit there and be in the studio with Jack Harlow talking about what's good, what's popping, brand new whip just hopped in. We don't give a damn about that. We ain't trying to be down, down bad with Dreamville, damn it. We trying to be up good playing some good basketball. But yet somehow, some way, you stupid bastards just can't get it right. I call Crystal Dynamics can't get right Dynamics, but honestly, 2K, y'all are right there with them. And the craziest part is, is y'all have a bigger budget and a bigger fan base, and yet somehow, some way, you have found out to piss off. You have found a way to piss off everyone. What do these rappers being influenced and being put in the game have anything to do with the gameplay? Have anything to do with this being a fun game to play? I'll answer that for you. Not a damn thing. This ain't nothing. This ain't nothing but more smoke and mirrors. For another game that's going to be absolute trash because the developers and the company that sell this game are just that absolute trash. Well, I guess trash make trash nowadays, right? If iron sharp as iron, then trash belongs with trash. Y'all can keep this game, bro. Unless I see good reviews, y'all can miss me with this shit. I'm out.